guys, welcome to Fruity Minute Budget. I'm Kelly and it is a weekly weigh-in time or no, monthly weigh-in time. So I don't know if you guys noticed, but I didn't do a weekly weigh-in this past week just because I've just kind of been reevaluating my channel and the content that I'm putting out. And I realized that my weigh-in videos were not getting a lot of views and I did a poll and it showed that you guys weren't really watching them. So I am deciding to do, at least for now, once a month weigh-ins. So I will be going over that at probably the beginning of the next month. So right now I'm gonna weigh in for the month of October and just kind of do a month long weigh-in. Do it kind of like the Skinny on Weight Loss. You guys, they're amazing. I absolutely love their channel. If you don't know the Skinny on Weight Loss, I will have them linked down below. But just kind of a tutorial, not tutorial, a I don't know, like a product update, what's going on in my life, what have I been loving, what has not been working for me, just all around update and have them a little bit longer but more beneficial so that you know that you can come and you are gonna get reviews on products, reviews on foods that I've found that I'm loving and different things like that. So jumping into the weight loss, I will have a picture up here of how the month went with all of my ups and downs and it wasn't the best month. I only lost 0.4 pounds the entire month, but there's been a lot of changes. And Jamie has gone back to traveling full time, and so he has gone a lot more, which I really need to take advantage in the fact of cooking more Weight Watchers foods. Typically I cook two dinners, a Weight Watchers dinner for me and a not Weight Watchers dinner for him, but I need to make more just Weight Watchers foods and not tell him because, yeah. So that I'm gonna really take advantage when he is gone of having super healthy foods of just like zoodles and different things like that that are really low points and just, just take advantage of that. And I have also gotten off the depot shot. So I don't wanna get into it too much. No, we're not trying to have kids. No, I'm not pregnant. But I have decided, Jamie and I, we really prayed about it and we really thought about a lot of getting off birth control just because of the hormones that it was adding to my body, the side effects. There were so many side effects that I didn't even realize were side effects until I was getting off of it. And um, so it's, it's definitely taken a change in my body of kind of coming off of that, the hormones, the getting my periods back because I haven't had my period in over a month, over a year and just kind of getting those back and different things and um, they're, they're intense ones because my body hasn't shed for a year, not to be TMI, but it's just been a really big adjustment for that. So it's been, it's been interesting and I've been off of it for a couple months now, but I can definitely tell my body is still going through hormone changes, which the nurse practitioner at my work said that I would be experiencing a big loss when I got off of it because one of the side effects of Depo is weight gain, but that has not been the case, but it is what it is. It's okay. So I have a couple products for you guys and I've seen them going around, but I decided to take the plunge and try Built Bars. Holy cow, guys, these are amazing. They're only three points each. I absolutely love them. They're incredible. So they have six different flavors. They have a chocolate raspberry cream a salted caramel, an orange double chocolate mousse, a mint one, and a coconut chocolate cream. Guys, they're awesome. So coupon codes for them, obviously. There is zero shipping whatsoever, which is awesome. I love products we don't have to pay shipping. And this box here is six, um, is six bars for $3 off the box. So it's a total of $3 for the box. So it's 50 cents a bar for three point bars. Guys, that's an incredible deal, 50 cents a bar. And then this one is 16 bars and $10 off your order. So if you want this one, use the code FIAB3, like freedom in a budget, the letters, FIAB3. This one is gonna be FIAB10 for $10 off this box. I think that brings it 20 something, I, I don't remember. I think 20 something, $22 I wanna say. I'm, I could totally be off. But I'll have everything linked down below in the description. So these bars, they're really good size too. So I'm gonna open one up for you guys. They're awesome, I love them. So I'm even getting my coworkers hooked on them. So this is the salted cream. And I'm not gonna eat it because I don't like eating on camera. I feel like that's gross and I don't like 
watching people eat on camera, so I'm not gonna eat it, so don't worry. You don't have to click off. But here's the size. So it's like the size of an actual like candy bar. And I'm gonna try and break it in half. Guys, look how thick that chocolate is. Like this is thicker than like a Klondike bar, Ch thick. It is real milk chocolate, which in the emails, they email you like, say like three times the email, do not leave in the sun. It is real chocolate. It will melt, 100% real chocolate. So I'm just gonna save this here for later. Oh, I'm really excited about that. Okay, so nutrition facts. So for each bar, 110 calories, four grams of fat, um, 13 grams of carbs, four grams of sugar, um 15 grams of protein and 35 grams of calorie from fat so they are really really good um and they are whey protein mix so good guys so coupon codes and they are obviously affiliate codes so i do get a little bit of a return in them so fiab3 for three dollars off the whole box is three dollars and this is fiab10 for ten dollars off all right so that's that then I have a whole bunch of stuff we're gonna talk about. Walking. So Jamie and I, as you guys know, I've been trying to get my exercise increase and Jamie and I decided to go for a walk yesterday, or not yesterday, last week, um, last Sunday afternoon. And he had been traveling and so he had slept most of the day. We slept through church and, or he slept through church and I decided that at like three o'clock, I was like, babe, like, let's just go for a walk. You need to get outside. You need to exercise and do a little stuff. So he was like, yeah, let's go for a walk. It was kind of fall, as fall as in like 70s, not 80 degrees. And the humidity was down a little bit. So there's a park that's close by us that's like a quarter mile track. So I said, let's go to the park and do it. So we get there and it's like, babe, I've been wanting to go walk through the neighborhood across the street. Let's go, why don't we do that for a walk instead? Cause it's all these like multi-million dollar houses and let's go walk through and see what, you know, see what houses and just kind of dream and talk and chit chat and whatever. So we did that and we walked over four miles. It was like 4.02 miles. And it was, it was well over an hour, but we had just kind of talked time, you know, stopped and take some pictures and just enjoyed ourselves and talked. And it was just such great, like husband wife bonding time, dream building of, you know, what we want in our house and this and that and different things. Um, but I will say that the last mile, my feet were killing me, absolutely killing me. And even the next day, my feet were hurting because of my sneakers. Now I'm hoping that as I can kind of work myself up that my feet don't hurt anymore. It wasn't really like hurting as in aching. It was hurting because my shoes were, were just super sore and just so, I think they were too tight. Um, but yeah, but we had a really great time and it was so much fun and just great to go through the neighborhood and not just necessarily going through a park. Um, we live in a part of town where we don't really have neighborhoods, so it's hard to do that. But, you know, we had to drive five minutes and it was fine. So super fun. We want to do that more often in the fall. We had a blast. And it was great to get that those four miles in. I hit 10,000 steps. Um, just I put on my Apple Watch like right before the walk and I had over 10,000 steps by the time that I went to bed. So that was like not even half the day. So it was great. All right, next up, Teamy. Teamy, Teamy, Teamy. So I have shared Teamy a lot in the past. This is the Teamy Skinny and it's, I'm not a tea drinker, guys. Like, I'll be honest, I'm a coffee drinker. The only time I drink tea is when I'm sick. And that is how I know I'm sick is because I want tea and not coffee. So when I started drinking tea, I was like, I don't like tea. So I actually like this tea, which is surprising. And I found some even ways to make it better. So you guys saw, you've seen my like past what I ate videos of adding pineapple juice to it, which is incredible. Well, today I had a pomegranate, which I've never bought in a pomegranate myself. And it took like 20 minutes to open it up and deseed it, but it produced so many seeds, I was surprised. So I put pomegranate seeds in my Teamy Skinny. Guys, it is a game changer. It makes it so good. I put a bunch in the measuring cup and I just kind of muddled them with a the back of a spoon. Oh, so good, guys. So yeah, so here it is with the Teamy Skinny and pomegranates. Who would have thought? 
So I am going back to the basics and doing the Teamy 30 Day Detox. I've done this in the past, but I decided, you know what, we're gonna do it again and it's gonna be good. So for the detox, you have to do Teamy Skinny every day. Um, it's a teaspoon and you can use the water two or three times. So you just kind of refill it. This one, the reason why it's not a strong yellow is because it, this is the second go around. I already had one today and that's my second one. Um, and so you have one of these every single day and then you do the Teamy Colon every other day. And this is, helps clean you out, but it's a very gentle cl cleanse. It's not too much. It's not like cramping. It's not running to the bathroom. It's, it's a good, it's a good natural cleanse. Um, I love this stuff. I really do. I bring this on trips because when I go on trips, I cannot go to the bathroom. And so it really helps with that. And so it's, it's really good. And it's very soothing. They do have a lemon one that is out now that I am going to be ordering this week. And I'm really excited for it. So I do have a promo code of 25% off and order $34 or more through the end of the year. So that is budget 25 for 25% off anything on the store. You guys know that I love Teamy. I love their face oils. I started using their um, oil repair on my face every night and I absolutely love it. I don't have any foundation on right now, just like some like eye makeup and then bronzer and highlighter, but no, um, no foundation and it's completely changed my skin. It's awesome. Awesome, awesome. So budget 25 for that. I got so many codes for you guys. I'm just hooking you up with the discounts. All right, and lastly is my ribbon. So I haven't brought out my ribbon in quite some time. This is just a visual reminder of what I'm doing to keep, I don't want to say keep myself accountable, but keep myself focused on not just the scale. So this week, I'm, this month on scale, I only lost 0.4 points. Yeah, that sucks. But if I'm working out and I'm gaining muscle, then I'm going to be losing inches. Have I worked out and gained muscle in the month of September? No, I, I've been slacking. So I really wanna get back into it and start using this more. I did have, the last time I used this was 818. So it has been two months now, almost two months. And I've lost a little bit. So you guys can see here's the first one, here's the second one, here's the third one. So. Maybe this will help a little bit more. So I've lost a little bit each time, but yeah, I gotta get my button here, guys. So I'm pumped, I'm excited. I think that these new way in videos are gonna keep me motivated. Um, I like the accountability of doing it once a week, but I don't know, I'm kinda excited about these ones, these month long weigh-ins. Let me know what you guys think. Do you enjoy my weekly weigh-ins? Are you guys, sad that they're going away what's what's going on let me know down below in the comments let me know if you have any tips or tricks for me just let me know guys all right i'll talk to you later bye